Hi everybody, it's X Reacts, and welcome back to another episode of Reaction of Fairy Tale. Today, moving on to episode 291, and last time we had again a ton of new answers get revealed to us about many different things, many questions I've had for the longest time. It feels about this show. Uh, I'm just going to try and unpack it a little bit, guys. Break it down a little bit uh, before we actually start the episode reaction. I'm going to start with Mavis and uh, her body and what she's in. This whole light luminous thing that uh, we've been kind of been teased about this whole time. We know it's a big power. Uh, we learned last time, guys, that it's called Fairy Heart, and it's basically a lacrima to keep her body, sustain her body this whole time, uh, prepped in, you know, after Fairy Tale Zero ended, we learned a lot more last time, guys, about their story kind of, kind of continuing, um, and Precht was basically putting Mavis's body after it was delivered to him from Zeref. Uh, this horrible moment that I'll get to in a moment, uh, but yeah, so Precht basically put her in there and then spent his whole adult life trying to research what happened to Mavis. Once he finally discovered it was, in fact, her curse, and it was much more than just a curse of staying young forever. It, we learned, guys, that it was the curse of contradiction. The same curse that Zareph has is what Mavis also has. Mavis uh, fought right after Fairy Tale Zero in that like trade war and kind of got the name Fairy Tactician, but that whole experience of battle nullified her senses it's kind of revealed so she didn't really have the curse take effect nobody died around her for the longest time because she was just in war constantly and that guys then you know once the war was finally over then she was able to then start kind of really loving again she named uh baby makarov and then right in turn her curse killed makarov's mother in childbirth and like that was a horrible moment um and that basically sent her off on her path alone. She she ran away from fairy tale, ran away from all her friends, and never to be seen again. And drifted for years in the forest and just wandering around, trying to hide, killing creatures, killing animals, all and, and people all around her, just being horrible, like and just devastated that this now is her life. Um, and so basically, guys, yeah. So she was found by Zeref. They had this whole connection. They. We were like, oh, maybe we can live together with the same curse. And they had some romantic moments, uh, you know, where it kind of seemed like more than just friends. And then Zareph kissed her and Mavis dies. And I'm like, oh, my God, like that was insane to me. But it turns out, guys, that she's not actually dead. It seems it seems that she's just like this any in like this internal slumber. And that's when Zareph delivered her to Precht and she's not dead she's not really alive either so she's just kind of in this stasis so he put her in that lacrima uh over time trying different spells to free her to wake her up doing all this and that then kind of combined out it's all like it's very confusing still to me but this all kind of got mixed up all the magic that he attempted to her everything that was existing within her already from the curse it all blended together and then fairy heart was born and fairy heart is this unlimited amount of magic like you will never drain of magic you will never run out and Zareph wants it Zareph you know they kind of said that you could you know they had all this power way back in the early episodes to uh, shoot the Ethereum cannon and it took all this build up to do that. And they kind of just said that the fairy heart is allowing you to then have unlimited Ethereum cannon blasts just constantly and just destroy the world and destroy everything uh, without end. And that's it. Um, and so Zareph wants it. Alvarez is going to invade. It's like imminent threat now is uh, going to invade. We have all of fairy tale regrouped finally. And they're saying, okay, we're not going to run. We're not going to hide. We're going to fight. We're going to bring the fight to them. We're going to be ready. And Natsu then says, Hey, I have a secret weapon in my arm. And that's a whole new question. I have like, what is that all about? Was that their, you know, been there all along? Is that some kind of new thing he gained in the year he was training? Um, I don't know. And we're going to find out guys soon, but last episodes, I gosh, like I'm still in shock because it, like, if you love fairy tale zero guys, go watch those episodes. It was like a direct continuation of fairy tale zero and all the great characters and moments that we kind of, kind of got left at, um, with that show. And now moving forward, we have, um, so many things getting revealed, so many things still unanswered, and 
time will, time will tell. Time is coming soon enough, guys, for those answers to be revealed. Um, I'm talking about uh, Zeref and Natsu. I'm talking about Natsu learning. He's the brother. I'm talking about E&D. All these things I still have, are. I feel like they're coming. It's only a matter of time now before we learn all the truth to everything. And I'm so excited. Thank you for joining me on this ride, guys. It means so much to me. Uh, please like this video if you haven't yet. Please consider subscribing to the channel if you haven't yet. And please consider supporting this channel on Patreon. We uh, have the link in the description below, so feel free to check it out if you are interested. And thank you to those of you that already done so. All right, guys. I think we're going to get started with episode 291. Here we go. And if you are wondering, I did cut out, guys, the opening credits. I was told to avoid them, that there are spoilers. So uh, the episode kind of started right with the opening credits. So I'm picking this uh, reaction up now right Powerful after the credits ended. I did not watch it. But. With a limitless potential. Seraph can't resist its destructive power and is launching an invasion of Ishgar to get it. We can't let that thing be used for evil. No, I shouldn't say it's a thing. It's the body of our first master, Mavis Vermilion, which is even more reason to keep it safe. Had it not been for her kind heart, Fairy Tale would never have brought us all together. Who knows where we'd be? Pretty good stuff there, Lucy. <laughs> if you keep it up, you could turn into a real novelist someday. <gasps> They're too much. The Magnolia Defensive War. Oh my God! It's starting. The war is here. I'm not ready. It's gonna be. It's gonna be crazy. I feel it. Like it's gonna be horrible. Like. Oh my God. Try to relax a little. The town is all empty and boring, so we decided to come over here. Well, I'm glad they were able to evacuate all the citizens, at least. Cut loose, Lucy. All right, that's good. We have citizens <laughs> have gone, yeah, which means on, that that tells me, guys, that all of Magnolia is just going to get wrecked in this fight. With a terrifying enemy tomorrow. I'm not feeling games, and unlike the two of you knuckleheads, I'm really not feeling all that excited about fighting either. Huh? Giving everything I've got in a fight to see how much I've grown is what I live for, but this time is way different. I'll do anything for us to win. Or else we won't survive this. Yeah, they're not fighting in a terminal. They're not I really want to do when it's over. Fighting they're like it's to survive. To they said that last is, time Lucy. and no, right they're right. There. Like Don't say a thing. I'm so this is nervous. A literary technique we writers call foreshadowing. And what does that mean? Like when someone talks about their future plans right before something big, but then a tragedy strikes and prevents them from fulfilling their dream. We're not scared to talk about the future. Aye. Igniel himself told me I should always talk about it. Because that's what gives us the strength to make it there. That's a nice way to look at it. <laughs> All right, let's play some games. Who's in for strip poker? I'm still confused. I don't think they flat out said, guys, with Mavis's uh, spirit that, you know, is able to just walk around and do stuff. Like, is that her, is that like a projection from the real Mavis in the light? That she's like so allowing herself to then interact with just fairy tale members, help? or is it something else? Is it just Seraph like her essence or spirit, or some a that third thing? I have no idea. A little bit better, although most of that crew were the ones who destroyed Kate's shelter. Well, they've changed. Ah, uh, that reminds me of the day I first invited you to join Fairy Tale. We're so grateful. Which also means I was the one who dragged them into this life, filled with so much fighting. Hey, Urza! Uh, this time I'll protect you for all you've done for me. That's a touching moment. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> I have loved watching you grow into Oh her. my. Everyone in the guild is so very proud of you. <laughs> Wendy's one of my favorites, guys. I love Wendy so much. She's grown so much in this show as a character it's like she's amazing are you okay my love i'm fine this is gosh like the bite. calm before the storm i'm so nervous my darling gray is sharing his food with me oh my god let's touch this i hope you know i appreciate you i can always count on you to be by my side right oh well uh, yes of course my love if that's what you want I'll give you my answer once the battle is over. But for now, let me focus on this. Sure. He's just teasing her. I'm gonna take down Zareth. 
with my secret weapon. Natsu's not the only one of us who's got a trick up his sleeve. So, Zeref, E.N.D., we're coming for both of you. Gosh, this is everybody's, like, last night of peace. Has your scanner picked up anything yet, Warren? There's been no sign of the enemy so inside nervous. of Fiori so far. That's good to hear, but are you positive we can put our trust in that thing? Our guild, they all seem so carefree despite the danger. Their bravery is quite remarkable. I think I may have a different read on the situation. Huh? The kids are all desperately trying to keep their anxiety at bay. So they're spending time with each other to pool their fortitude and lift one another's spirits. That is crucial at a time like this. When a parent is afraid, that feeling will be shared with their children. So it's a parent's duty to stand up in front of their children. And though they may tremble, plant their feet firmly into the ground. You're right. Oh my god. So good. What's that? I think something's happening outside. Is it starting? Oh my god. Is that fog? <laughs> Alright guys, I've seen this picture before of Levy and Gaggio with the same blanket. I had no idea the context. Now I know it's from this episode. But just to kind of show, you know, they tried to hide it a little bit, not showing them right back to back, but they are in the same bed. That's kind of funny. <laughs> Warren, is your contraption working properly? Or oh my god. Yes, of course it's working. So I'm like, I don't know that this is chills, magic. I'm nervous, I'm like shaking, my hands are shaking. How in the hell are and we here they are, oh my god. Approaching earlier. All members prepare for battle. They're coming from the sky. Oh my god. <laughs> Listen up, because I've traveled halfway around the world to do one thing, and that's to pulverize all of you into fairy dust. They're here now. Already? I don't think I'm ready for this fight, you guys. Fire! Well, goodbye, town. Oh, okay, no. Protection spell. Yeah, activate. let's go. Freed ah, to the rescue. Some kind of magic barrier. Now I need you to relay this message. Start strategy D. Flying dragons and ospreys. Commence the attack. Got it. This is Osprey reporting from the Eastern Woods. Target is currently too far out of range. Why is Mommy calling herself Osprey? Beats me. Visca, I have complete faith in you. Now what do we have here? That one's moving towards us really fast! Evasive maneuvers! Ship number four has been destroyed! The hell? Say hi to the Flying Dragon Squad! Let's go! It's that guy again. Now let's rock. Right. Curses. There's too much enemy fire. This guy needs to get shooting. This is awesome. Oh my. <laughs> Magic power charged and ready. Go, mommy. <laughs> she still has a scope on it. <laughs> get back. It takes 15 minutes to charge a shot. So I got to make wow. this one count. You're good. Don't worry. You've got this, honey. You know what an osprey is? A bird that never loses its prey. Nice. Focus magic cannon, Jupiter! Fire! Wasn't that Phantom Lords? When did we get it? Don't know. Let's hope it works. Nice try! That's awesome Avengers. connection. Back to Phantom Lord. He broke up the blast! Maybe, but it looks like you still took out a few ships. You guys really know how to break stuff. Oh my god. Oh no, we forgot this is a vehicle! What a huge oversight. Hey, Wendy, Jeez. time to use a Troya spell. I'm so sorry, you guys. 
Yeah. But I can't use it if I'm already feeling pukey too. That's no. Oh good. my god. <laughs> this completely slipped my mind. Oh, jeez. Whoa! The bow has been sliced off. Listen up, Happy, Carla, Lily, help them out. Let's go. I'm the woman who'll strike you down. You'd better beg for mercy. You're dealing with Titania. Kneel before the Fairy Queen. Thanks, Urza. She's got a way better chance fighting on a ship than we do. Yes, she's more equipped to handle the situation. How am I ever going to protect her if she's always protecting me? Defeating one of the Twelve will be nearly impossible even for a warrior like Urza. Yet I have faith in her ability. Charge it up! I gotta hurry up and shoot her before they destroy the town! She knows, sweetheart, but it takes a while to get it ready. I'm gonna blast that sucker this time. All right, men! Magnolia's right in front of you! But, Captain, how are we gonna Is this one of the, the 12, too? Time? Like. No clue, huh? There were like four or five or six Not a problem. We have someone that they've never seen that you know Makarov arrived, had no so info on. Will fall shortly. To be honest, I feel this overwhelming show of force is a tad bit Agile Division Kareem. Okay, so but still, I, I think they're the underlings of Agile, kind of like how that one. <laughs> yeah, Bakil. You know, you've done us a real favor by landing on the ground, so thanks! <laughs> Yeah, the one guy who could tr control space was kind of like in the Brandish division, so I, and he was like the underling of Brandish, so I feel like these aren't part of the 12. These are just, you know, second, third in command after Agil, probably. Like, gosh, they have a huge army, huge invasion, like... And they said this is not even the tip of their forces, like... It's going to be bad, guys. Like, I'm so afraid. Think that lame attack is gonna beat me? Black Wing Moon Flash! What's happening? You're decaying into dust. My requip magic isn't oh working, God. but why? Freed? Is there something wrong? There is. A hole's been opened in the enchantment. <laughs> this will prove to be an easy victory. This guy's so weird looking. Impressive work, Walser. We'll be done here in no time. They'll learn the strength of the Alvarez Empire. One last lesson before dying. I sense more magic power. Could another member of the Twelve have arrived? The enemy has entered Magnolia! Elfman! Lasana! Vera Jane! Get there quickly! I need to go and back them up. <sighs> Aquarius, please, lend me your strength. <gasps> what was that sound? Something's in here. Oh! Looks like I was right after all. I knew this was your place. Gets an A plus from me. Oh my god! <laughs> I knew this friggin' twelve were coming to Ishgar, but I wasn't expecting one of them in my bathtub. I don't know why, but you have been running through my mind ever since we met. Now there's another member of the twelve in Magnolia. Another one? Three of those monsters in one group? How are we gonna fight back against that? No, this can't be happening. Uh-oh, what is it now? A massive force of over 300 ships is coming in from the north! And judging from the magic power signature, it has another three of the twelve! <laughs> There's an identical group coming from the south as well! And this one has another three of them! 
They're making an approach on three sides? No. So that'll be nine of the twelve. There's also a million soldiers that are marching from the east. With three more than And 12. there's the last three, okay. We're completely surrounded. All twelve are coming. The enemy has left us with nowhere to run. <sighs> How are they coming from the east? They must have cut through Bosco to pull that off. It's like they're throwing everything they have at us all at once. This is the worst thing that could happen. No matter how She'll I figure something out. We have no chance of winning. Maybe. <laughs> God. All right, guys. Let's see what happens next. All right, guys. Moving on with episode 292. We are at the Western Hill with the Dragon Slayers, it looks like. Gosh, and I'm like, I'm so... So freaking out, guys! Like in my head, like I'm like, okay, like this is the final season, kind of like I said in the beginning, guys. I like anybody could die. We don't know for sure. Type. That is the only reason he's it's the It's very possible, and I, I'm not gonna be ready nice for anyone to die. Like I love Give every character. Like I cannot oh, get enough good. of this show and his characters. Fine, and I'm just like, on, gonna get so worked up. Oh my god! Yeah, I know. But still. There's gonna be more of these clowns to take out. I gotta be smart. Oh my god. <laughs> Get out of the way! Carla to the rescue, let's go. Back to scum. Sky Dragon! Nice. Kareem of the Agil Division. Here to carry out my orders. Oh my god, I'm not ready. Morningstar, let's go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so yeah, we have the whole Slayer group up there. We have Western Streets of Magnolia. Sure are a lot of these Juvie. jerks. That's true, but we faced more in the fight with Avatar. We need a uh, huh? unison raid. Take them all a out. Real Let's go. Man dropping in to lend a hand. Thanks, Elfman. <laughs> Lizana's here too. Let's go, Mira. Satan's soul form. Oh, is it a new one? Oh my God! Mira Jane, Sailor Girl. Oh, even sounds like her. Hell, you were able to use your takeover magic on her. So does that mean that she you have her curse Sheila, power right? too? <laughs> yeah, that's what happened. Otherwise, Sailor would have died. She's so sweet. I have the best sisters. <laughs> sweet, huh? Oh she did steal her body. <laughs> wow. I order you all. That's awesome. Like, I'm so like, oh my gosh. It, it was this like the new power that she was kind of teasing early before, or is there even more that she can do? Like, this is so cool. It didn't work on some of them. I know what to do. Give him a smackdown. <laughs> That's so manly! Wow. <laughs> ah, the demon curse. This guy looks so weird. Now I get it. One of you guys She's in my comments last video Bruce mentioned that he looks like Gru from Despicable Me, and I just lost it. Like, it's so funny. Oh my god, so many battles going on. I don't know what to do. Don't know what to think. I'm just so nervous that something can go wrong. You, there's going to be nothing left but a cloud of sand blowing in the wind. Why can't I requip right now? Is the Jupiter ready to fire? It's pointless anyway. Even if we survive this wave, they're just going to keep sending bigger ones. Give my order now. I need your telepathy, Warren. <laughs> Warren! Would you stop trying oh, to get yourself together? <laughs> We're all scared, okay? Look at me. I can barely stop my legs from trembling to stand up. What am I supposed to do? You're supposed to fight Follow with us. Follow orders. They're trying to destroy our home and way of life. We have a duty to protect Fiore. <laughs> Oh my God! That broom. Osprey unit, do you read? This is war. You know what to what say to that? Needs five more minutes, then we blast him. Good luck. We're counting on you to save the guild. It did help. Come on, let's Thanks, go. Max. Let's go. Mm. I don't understand what you're doing here. <laughs> Taking a bath. What else? I want you to get in with me. Oh my. What? First you break into my house and use my bathtub, and now you actually expect me to join you? Are you insane? Or just Don't stupid? Don't repeat myself. 
I don't like having to do that. <laughs> oh. Oh, I get it. Because of him. Hey, A plus, don't be shy. Oh, <laughs> come on! Please, my lady, don't do this to me. There's no need to fight it. Besides, your guild lost the war the moment I came here. You remember what my mother She's so intriguing, me. like I in just the blink of an eye. She's, she's almost like not quite of an a villain. I like to do a step on it. For now. She's so different than the rest. The They're like I don't know what to make of her yet. You understand what I'm saying, don't you? There's no need to cry. As long as you do exactly what I tell you, nobody's gonna get hurt. Oh, what's that? The building next door. I should. Oh, wow. It. I'm not asking you. This is me giving you a direct order. Get in the tub. Can I get a little peek? Just kidding. I can't use my magic as long as that guy's around. I don't know what she's really after. I'll take her challenge. It's a naked battle. Oh, <laughs> Wow. You're not looking very cute. So you should put this on. Are you being serious? <laughs> it's like fan oh, service, but there's an underlying normal. threat that, this girl's deal? you know, you like, I if you upset her, she's just going to like... Shrink the planet or something. I like, it's gonna be insane. I was a reporter there and a model for about a year or so. We don't get your Eastern magazines in Alvarez. Maybe it was in last year's Grand Magic Games. What is that? That's weird. I can't remember. Hold on a second. Did you really go to these ridiculous lengths just to figure that out? Yeah, so what? Speaking of ridiculous, how can we have a serious convo while you're in Cadillac? <laughs> anyway. Think you could scrub my back for me? Why in the heck am I doing this? You haven't told me your name. It's Lucy. Uh. Well, I'd be more than happy to scrub your back, my lady. Her guard is down. Now's my chance. I'll take down one of the twelve. The I can stabber. do it. Shanker. Are you Layla's daughter? <gasps> you. Oh, my mom? That's what it is. You're Layla's only daughter. That's the reason I know you. <gasps> oh my god! Oh no, the plot the thickens! Is shrinking. Gotta run! Wait! The entire building is shrinking! No. Is it a good <laughs> thing or a bad thing she knows <laughs> Lucy's mom? To think you live in that dump. Still, I'm glad I found you. Who are you? And what connection do you have to my mother? It's too much of a hassle to explain. Get the hell away from Lucy, you Yeah, weirdo! let's go! Magnolia isn't your personal playground, you know. So you need to get out of here. Kana! Am I interrupting something between you two? Because it looks like some kinky stuff is going <laughs> down. You really got the wrong idea about this! Anyway, it's all oh, okay my. now. Hey, what's going on out there? Whoops! Yeah. Marin. Now I can use my celestial spirit magic. My star Let's go. Aries form. New air, new Aries dress. Let's go. Battle on Tenro. Yeah, definite Tenro Island flashbacks yeah, having Kana and Lucy team up again. My equipment is back. That wind? Wind god armor! <sighs> that seemed a whole lot tougher for you guys than I expected. Give me a freaking break. It's because we were holding back. I was only using like one one hundredth of my power to fight those guys. Well, whoop de doo! I was using one tenth! That means you struggled more than I did! <laughs> Another whip of ships. It's like there's no end to them. Oh my god. Master Mavis said it would be like this. Give up now! <laughs> How can you beat our army when this is all you've got? 
You losers can't even handle the Argeal Division! Natsu! We can't, huh? What? See you later! <laughs> I think I'm just gonna stay down. What the hell? Thanks, Natsu. For sharing... Uh, your fighting spirit! Uh, uh, no way! Ouchie! Uh, no blade can ever cut me! <laughs> A water sword? Yeah, let's go! Uh, the Sea Empress sword solidifies your sand! So it is like the Sandman you getting them wet fight. in Spider-Man 3. Like you was nothing compared to me. <laughs> Let's go. You made a mistake when you took me on. No one can beat the Great Ozil. My Wind God Sword can blow away your sand. Sand is feeble in so many ways. I believe a sand storm would change your mind. <laughs> it's covering the whole ship. And more. Where'd this sand come from? I bet that sand wizard is doing it. It's hurting my eyes! Now what? More enemies are coming. You can't step back. Us dragon slayers can use our noses to find the bad guys. What's with all the sand? Make sure that the doors and windows are tightly shut. <laughs> oh, Sheol. You're always such a pain. My darling Greg! <laughs> He's using sand. Oh my. Seems they have a fighter strong enough to push Agile to extremes. Oh crap. This stupid sand spell is getting through the hole in your enchantment. Damn it. Ugh, this is horrible. The Jupiter is finally ready to fire again. But it's impossible to aim with this. It's in my eyes, Daddy! Keep them shut. You're gonna be okay. No way. It's covered all of Magnolia with Jeez. They have the power to shrink an island and create massive weather events. They're truly unlike any foe that fairy tale has ever faced. Let me welcome you to the sand world. In here, I am God. And I reign without mercy. <laughs> Ramalzi! <laughs> Pathetic! You don't have a chance! Oh. <laughs> Recognize me as your god, and start begging me for my forgiveness. Do that, and I'll show you mercy. I'll grant you an instant death. My strength is fading. Jeez. It's excruciating. My magic can dry up all the water in your body, the source of life itself. Do you want to shrivel up and die painfully in that way? <laughs> Say god, and I'll end your suffering. <laughs> you are strong, but still, you are not a god. And even if you were, my guild, my friends, would never bow down because we're not afraid. Huh? And we don't put our faith in just anyone. We know exactly where to look. Morning Star Armor! You're wasting your time! Ramel Fess! Now, your head is mine! Oh, do it, Biscuit, let's go! It's coming from the fleet! I see it, yes. And I know exactly what it is. That's Urza's light! Uh, yeah! Uh, Impossible! Did you get him? You know mommy never misses a shot. Hm. Uh. Nakagami! Yeah, let's go. Starlight! Uh. Uh. 
Wow. Oh my god. I feel like I didn't breathe that whole clear again. the last five sure minutes. <laughs> my gosh. Alright, well, we'll see uh, next time, guys. Let's keep going. We'll see if that did it. Okay, guys, moving on with episode 293, and <laughs> signs are looking good for the moment, but this war is far from over. Ooh, Catcher. This is, like, so reminiscent of Lucy falling in the Infinity Clock arc. Go with wow, Natsu. like, very, She's very close visuals there. We can handle all the riffraff here. Better back her up, Blue. Aye! I gotcha! Good job. Urza, you okay? Wake up! Huh? Oh, thank goodness. I think Wendy's on her way. Oh. Got him. <laughs> Biska, the MVP, man. Love it. For whom the parfum flows. So, imagine Ichi is coming back here. The sandstorm's finally over. Good, but I'm sure there's more trouble. <laughs> what is the deal with all the crazy pollen in this town? Allergies? I guess the wind from that sandstorm whipped up all the pollen and crap in the air. Oh, this is freaking annoying! <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> wow. Sucker punch. She left herself wide open, so... Looks like she's down. Jeez, is that really all it takes to knock out one of the twelve? What should we do with her? She's our prisoner. I don't know, what guy. I'm not buying it. Like... I can see. I don't think she's down that easily. The sand's beginning to clear. There's five. Works for me. They have a strange magic energy. Yeah, they do. Be careful! Get ready! Nice. Physical attack. That just won't work on me. <laughs> Julia! A steam attack? They got fire too? And the one fighting me has steam. What the hell's with this? So they're guy? able to like so fast! Now! Manly punch! Come up with whatever counterattack that would be best against that user's magic ability, maybe? Oh no! I can't hurt him! They're using fire against my ice, steam against Juvia's water, yeah, okay. speed against Elfman's power, and power against Lazana's speed. They're using our weaknesses against us. Lucky for us, Mira doesn't have any weaknesses. <laughs> nice. Uh, oh. No. Sorry, Big Sis. I didn't mean Oh my god. Hey! You're arguing with the fake, you know! You! You did this! They're gonna have to do, uh, where they, like, fight different ones, or unless these robotic weird things can, like, alternate their attacks or magic. I don't know. I don't know, man. Take out the source. That's that's what you gotta do, I guess. Well, that explains it. My weakness soldiers can deal with your lot, I'm sure of that. As for me, I shall dispatch with that loathsome enchantment user and nullify the barrier for good. What? Apparently, Urza and Visca put one of the Twelve out of commission. Huh. More reassuring news. It's a disgrace. That failure brings shame to the Twelve, indeed. <laughs> We're Loxus's personal Worry, guys. bodyguards, like... after all. Part of the Thunder Legion's duty is to maintain our fearsome reputation. I can see it clearly. What you're best at and where you will fail. Take them down. Line formation, babies! Fairy bomb gremlin! Missed. What's going on? My fairy dust won't work? Oh, jeez. Man, this sucks! My black magic keeps getting cancelled out by his white magic! Then try looking them in the eye. <laughs> Come on! That doesn't work either. Now turn to stone! Won't work on me. <laughs> Big slow! Evergreen! Nothing's landing on this guy! 
Indeed, none of your attacks will. <laughs> oh my god, what is he? Because I'm not human. I'm a mechanical being. A Machias. He's a machine that can wield magic power? Oh. There we go. Take him out, Loxus. Is that lightning? Loxus! Zup, zup! Oh! <laughs> I believe what the doctor ordered here is some shock treatment. With a blast of my thunder, Okay. <laughs> Poor Freed. What are you doing here? Huh. Don't tell me you've forgotten your previous indignity. No matter. We'll chat after I eliminate this bastard. How could I have confused this half pint troll for one so great as Loxus? That's weird. Just got the chills. <laughs> something wrong with you? Nah. Indeed. Oh my it god. It's no difference how many are in your number. Hmm. I can determine all your weaknesses so with minimal effort. Mistake! <laughs> how can he be this fraud? Man. Ichio's in a class all his own. The dude's got so many weaknesses, the enemy doesn't even know where to begin. <laughs> so Although our time spent together was brief, you three were members of my beloved Blue Pegasus Guild. In other words, you and I are like family. As a rule, no one harms my family and gets away with it. I know fairy See, they're alone, or is like all the Blue Pegasus coming to help? No, quick and fear before me, there is no escape. That's my poison, Papu! Alas, I lack the ability to perceive smell. Oh, you don't have a nose! Besides that, I'm a Machias. Your countless weaknesses had me a bit flummoxed indeed. But it's quite simple. You're oh. just a weak! Hit him all! Jeez. <sighs> Ichia! Every last machine has the same undeniable weakness. Thunder Parfum with Mystified Big Section! <laughs> yes, that's right. You're no match for the power of lightning. Just as Thunder Man! Since my magic exploits weaknesses, I learned a while ago to eliminate any that I found within myself. So I proceeded to address my own failings and can now convert lightning into a usable energy source. Is he serious? Of course he can. Vortex George! This guy's so weird, but like, not an easy pushover villain. Oh, jeez. Indeed, the more lightning of yours that I absorb, oh, wow. the easier it will be for me to smite you all. It's really weird looking. <laughs> So will you let it fall in order to defend yourself? Or will you die in vain while trying to protect the entire town? A tough decision indeed. Hey! What's going on? I'm coming to help you! Stop yelling! It's telepathy, you know, so he can hear you just fine! <laughs> no, stay away! Huh? We're the Thunder Legion. We're your personal guard. Our sole purpose has been to protect you. Oh my god, something's gonna happen. I'm not liking moment, this. We must protect the guild. So you are still alive. If you knew us, that wouldn't be any kind of surprise. We're not the types to go down without a real fight. I see. Then my weakness soldier shall give you one. If you guys are fighting more than one, switch up your targets. You hear me? Is that an elfman? This one's a piece of cake. Go, Gray. Yeah, I'll there you go. Fire one with water. I'll go against the more powerful machine. The fast one is kind of a joke to me. I guess that means oh, I gotta beat up creepy oh, robot me. Please, please help me, manly. So the weakness soldiers have flaws. How ironic. It was this simple. Well, if that's the case, let's rip them. White magic All right. doesn't cancel out my spells. And my trusty little babies don't give a crap about some stupid mess. I'm afraid it's too late to turn the tide. We took down the Western forces! I <laughs> What you've done is inspiring. Now I can give Let's my go. all to the fight at hand. Yeah. Dark Echo Wow. Absolute shadow! Smell the power, Parfum! 
If Freed turned into that ever before in the show, I don't remember it, guys. I'm sorry. But that's really cool. I'm so excited to rewatch the earlier episodes, guys, because I never paid attention the way I was supposed to. And I can't wait. Oh yeah! This is awesome! I'm gonna probably be learning half the stuff for the first time and then the big That's stuff I'll just get to reminisce about. So Seems we've somehow it'll be good. managed to weather the first wave of the storm, first master. Step on it. Wait, Ichia, how long have you been in Magnolia? Don't tell me you've forgotten. You seriously don't remember what happened a few days ago. Man. We've come for the Lightning Dragon Slayer! And over the Thunder Legion, too! Now, wait a moment. We're gonna need to borrow your ship, Pichia! I've always wanted to take a ride on that thing! Hold your horses, ladies. Alvarez! We're coming for ya! Let's get him! Hang on a minute, please! My amazing family came to rescue me! Friends. Yeah! Master! They had a bit of help, you know. We're back! <laughs> I'm Mr. Magnolia! <laughs> I'm standing right here. For each yeah. And that happened about a week ago! Well, then perhaps you should have gone home. What? Do you appreciate everything that goes into a long flight such as that? So we it never <laughs> massive amounts of preparation and maintenance, not to mention all the fuel costs! And then lo and behold, Alvarez has the gold to come attack Fiore! It really pisses me off a lot! Sorry about that, buddy. I'm not old! Just experienced. Ichia! Uh oh. Get away! Hmm? <laughs> oh my god, no! Oh my god. Guys, you okay? Please, just say something! Hey, Freed! Evergreen! Pixlo! I guess we had it coming. Uh, I'm just glad you're okay. We were in the same guild. That bond can be stronger than blood. You mean that? I... Hey, what just happened? Don't know. It's really hard to tell. Like, I don't know what to say, guys. I'm enough with the creepy cackling, okay? Knock it off for one. Are they okay? Like, I'd I'm still confused. Like, did they the die? <laughs> like, I don't think so. This I'm. Little excursion is turning out to be way Oh, his real body. Wall, Wall's real indeed. body. Okay. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm done with the. Indeed. Makes a little more sense now. Because <laughs> he looked really weird be before. <laughs> but okay. Oh, so the fairy brats broke your plaything, did they? Honestly, I did consider that a possibility. They gotta be all right. Like, but most they've, surprising they've survived worse. The, the enemy was able to defeat Agile and take Brandish into custody this quickly. <laughs> Hilarious. They captured her? Talk about a hassle. We're almost to the port, and our first order was to take it out. <laughs> you really think you can do it from here? It's still like 30 kilometers away. No. Oh God! I'm actually gunning for the fairy tale guild hall. That's got to be ten times farther. You don't have a chance. How dare you underestimate me? I'm Wall the Great Machias. Now watch me! They just hey, built it. Are they gonna destroy it now? Freed! Are you there? Please respond! Ah! <laughs> hey! There's something huge coming our way! Whoa! It's magic power! Whatever that is, it's super fast and headed right for us! Their army? Get out no. of there? I bet they're firing some kind of long-range attack. Can they seriously hit us from that far away? Freed, we need you! Put your enchantment back up! Freed! It's gonna uh. be a direct hit! Evacuate the guild now! Oh no! Is our guild hall gonna get flattened? Yes, again? get out of there! Not if I can help it. 
Stop arguing. Who was that? Who is it? The Christina! That was Ichia? Nice. What the? This is a battle, but it is not yours to fight alone. Yeah, yeah let's go. Calling all of Fiore! No! Oh my god, Listen we're getting them all. This battle belongs to all of us. Yes. This is what I wanted, guys, back at Tartaros. I wanted all the guilds to come together. They did it so quick. They tried to attack the faces, but it wasn't. Oh, God, it's, it's going to be so good. I'm so excited. We're going to have everybody, all the guilds, all the characters, all together, finally. Oh, my God. Oh, I'm like... I don't know what to say, guys. I'm like emotional, so I'm like drained. <laughs> like, so much is happening right now. Oh, jeez. So this is my first time, guys, watching these ending credits. Uh, looks like we have El Alvarez and Fairy Tail kind of like rotating on that little spinning clock, and we have Zeref and Natsu walking and running. Gosh, and just thinking back, guys, to like when I watched this ending in my ending reaction video, my second video I ever did on this channel. It's really bad. Don't go watch it. But um, I had no idea what was going on and who, who any of these people were. I, I'm trying to remember, too, a little bit like what I said or what I was kind of guessing or predicting back then. Um, but gosh, like it's it's crazy. This showdown is coming soon. It has to be coming soon. Oh my god. And I remember not even knowing for sure if this was Zarif or knowing anything of like the relationship there because I just started watching it at the games guys when I wa did that reaction video of the ending the first song. wave of attacks has been pushed back for now, but there's still a war going on and things will only get tougher. Our fellow wizard guilds across Fiore rise up and join the battle to defend our homeland, while fairy tactician Mavis initiates her new plan. Out to the west, Natsu and Happy speed across the sky, ready to fight. Nice. Next time, Natsu versus Zero. Oh, wow. The black wizard sees death approaching and greets it with We're a quiet We're jumping spine. right into that fight next. Wow, oh my god. Well, that'll be an awesome video. <laughs> I can't wait. All right, that'll be out next week, guys. Uh, oh, my god. So, yeah, I was kind of saying, guys, in back in my ending reaction of the songs, like when I saw that little shot of Zarif and Natsu kind of as kids sitting together by that tree, I had no idea that that was even Zarif. I kind of think I guessed it in the video reaction, but, like, I didn't know for sure because I just started watching. I got to the point where the games started, and I was like, just introduced to Sabretooth and not and Sting and Rogue. And I think I was mixing up Rogue and Zarif, and I didn't really because they kind of looked similar at the time to me. And I didn't really know because you gotta understand, guys, when I watched like the Island Dark and all those early episodes of Fairy Tale, like I didn't really pay attention like I am now and I like I can't remember a single thing Zarif said or did on the island I know he was there with Natsu and so I'm going to be really excited when we get to that part when in my rewatch of the first 175 because I kind of did it backwards guys I was so tempted to, to start back at episode one on, when I began this channel but I was too into the show and so I just I was like I gotta see what happens next especially with that cliffhanger at 175 you guys probably know what I'm talking about if you've seen that episode and so I, was, so I jumped in right with 176 and we are moving forward from there guys but I definitely do plan to go back and do the 175 afterward and just kind of revisit some of the stuff and probably experience it for the first time because I really did not pay attention to half of it probably more than half I should say and it's going to be great. I cannot wait. I'm so excited because now I'm going to kind of know a little bit. And uh, I can't wait. It's going to be good. Natsu versus Zarif is going to be good. That's next time it looks like. Like I can't imagine that's going to be a quick fight. They're going to be fighting for a while if I had to guess. But, oh, my God, I can't wait. It's gonna Maybe that'll be when Zarif reveals some stuff to Natsu about being his brother and E&D maybe. So that'll be crazy if that gets revealed. I don't know what's going to happen, guys. I can't wait. Uh but we'll find out next time guys thank you so much for joining me again on this ride i cannot believe we're nearing the end we're getting there slowly but surely and uh really appreciate you guys sticking around every week uh joining me on this fairy tale ride of uh 
epic journey it is, you know. So thank you guys so much. Please drop a comment down below. Let me know what you thought of this reaction of these episodes. I'd love to chat with you guys about it as always. Uh, other till then, guys, we'll be back next Friday for more fairy tale. Please also check out, guys. In the meantime, more Black Clover and Eden Zero episode reactions, and I'm having more on the way. So uh, till then, guys, take care. Have a great day, and we'll see you soon.